Hello and welcome back to the Galley of the Sun. Well, tomorrow we shall dine like kings. Therefore, tonight we shall make marinades like marinating people do. So we're making Iranian lemon saffron chicken wings. So Iran is the source of one of the oldest civilizations in the world. So it only makes sense that they've been making food for a long time. Therefore, it only makes sense that they make some very good food. And it is true. This recipe here I have made four or five times. Typically, the first time I will do the recipe exactly like the recipe. And then I will think about how can I tweak it to make it my own. I have never changed anything in this recipe. It is absolutely perfect. So the first thing we need to do is to get our saffron steeping. So I'm taking about two tablespoons of hot water. The amounts are down in the description. I am doubling this recipe because it's so damn good. All right, into our hot water goes two teaspoons of saffron. Saffron is the most expensive spice in the world. About 90% of it of the world's supply is grown in Iran and they are the biggest exporter of saffron. Oh, this stuff is incredible. A little bit goes a very long ways. We're doing six pounds of chicken wings today and all I need is two teaspoons of saffron. There we go. We'll give it a little stir and let it set for five minutes and we'll move on to something else. The next thing we need for this marinade is onions, a lot of onions. We're gonna use two medium-sized onions and we're gonna grate them. Okay, our onions are done, into the brinder bucket. If you do a lot of brining and you do a lot of entertaining, you need one of these. It'll make your life a lot easier. And with the onions. Okay, so our onions are in. Next goes in two cups of Greek yogurt. Once again, I'm doubling the recipe. We follow that with our salt and our pepper. So I've got the ingredients in here except for the saffron. The saffron has another couple minutes so we can get the next step ready. So I also need half a cup of olive oil, which I have here. I also need half a cup of lemon juice. So one of the techniques to get the most juice out of the lemon is to take it and roll it while pressing down on your cutting board. The idea is, is that it gets the juices all dizzy, so then when you break it, the lemon apart, they can't hold on to things and they just fall out, I think. So you could use the stuff that comes out of the little yellow lemon-shaped jars that come from the grocery store, but we're putting saffron in this chicken, the most expensive spice in the world. It only makes sense that we use fresh lemon juice. And four lemons later, three lemons later, we're there. All right, so, so, so we're going to take half of the saffron water mixture and we're going to set it aside to make the glaze, which we'll make tomorrow when we're making the wings. The rest of it's going in this marinade. Okay, it doesn't seem like much, but this stuff goes a long way. The rest of our saffron goes in with the yogurt and onion mixture. All right, let's get those mixed together. All right, we got all that mixed together. Now we add, with a whisk, the olive oil and the lemon juice. All right, this smells absolutely amazing. So now we add our chicken and we mix. So even if you are the type that is uh, not squeamish at all about getting the hands in your cooking, uh, mixing meat with marinade and stuff like that, when you do this, you do want to use gloves. That saffron will turn your hands red very quick. Check it in. And you can see that I'm using the chicken wings that have the flat and the drummy still attached. Makes it way easier for grilling. Now we get in there and mix it all up. All right, so we get the plate in to get the chicken underneath the marinade. That's a beauty of this bucket. We'll get the lid on it. It goes in the refrigerator. And then tomorrow, the magic happens. Cut! All right, here we are. It is wing day. So the first thing we're going to do before we get those wings out of the marinade is make the glaze. So the glaze is made up 
remember, I'm doubling the recipe. All the uh, amounts are down there in the description. Using a stick of butter, using the leftover saffron from yesterday, and the juice of a lemon. Uh, it says three tablespoons for a single, six tablespoons for a double. I'm just gonna do a whole lemon on this. So, remember first we roll the lemon to get the uh, juices dizzy. Okay, ready to juice that puppy. So, to the stove. All right, so the pan's heating on medium heat. In goes the butter. We'll get that melted up first before we get the saffron and the lemon juice in there. The butter's there, in with the saffron. Once again, be careful with that saffron because it will stain anything it touches red. Saffron's in, juice of a lemon, and we mix. Okay, so got the smoker set up for direct cooking, set at 425, but first of all, my director uh, issued a correction that I must make. Saffron will stain things yellow, not red. Yellow, not red. Yellow, not red. So. Get ready to get our chicken out of the marinade. Been sitting there overnight. Once again, the gloves, because of the saffron. Oh, that smell will make you want to eat raw chicken. All right, so because this was yogurt-based, uh, it's going to cling to the wings pretty good. So you want to get most of that off of it. All right, so the wings are ready. Now it's out to the smoker. All right, here we are out at the smoker. So here is the grilling plan. So we're going to put these, um, I guess we'll call it pretty side. We'll put the presentation side down, uh, let it go for about 10 minutes. Then we're going to flip them. We're gonna baste the tops, let it go for another 10 minutes. Then we're gonna baste those bottoms, flip them for two minutes, and then we're done. Here we go. All right. Be back in 10 minutes. All right, it's been 10 minutes. Time for the flip and the first glaze. All right, see you in about 10 minutes. All right, so we're ready for one more flip, and this is just to get another layer of glaze on it. So we're gonna flip them, glaze them, wait about a minute, flip them, glaze them again, and then putting them on the serving platter. Keeping them all on the same side at all times make it very easy to figure out which ones you have and have not flipped. Okay, so we have them in a nice pretty pile now. We have a little bit of our basting sauce left. Remember, saffron, most expensive spice in the world. Don't waste a bit of that. So we'll drizzle that over the top of everything. All right, one more step and we're ready to eat. Time to go back inside. Okay, so poured the remainder of our basting sauce on top of it. The last step is drizzle it, which is Snoop Dogg's favorite cooking term, de-rizzle. We're gonna de-rizzle some pomegranate molasses on top of the whole dish. You can get pomegranate molasses from your Asian grocery store or you can get it from Amazon. Drop it like it's hot, drop it like it's hot, drop it like it's hot. Now the moment of truth, let's give it a taste. Drop it like it's wow, hot, it's hot. Drop it like it's hot, drop it like it's hot. Mm. The lemon, the onions and saffron, there's no taste like saffron. I can't describe it to you. I just implore you to give it a try. If you like what you saw today, hit that like button. Is there something that you'd like to see us cook? Comment down below. Have you ever cooked with saffron before? Comment down below. And if you've enjoyed this whole thing, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Thank you very much, and you have a great day. I certainly will.